Hey there, welcome to this week's tutorial. I'm gonna show you how to install your Pinterest base code on your Divi website. So let's jump in and get started. So your first things first, you're gonna to wanna to go to Pinterest and you're gonna to wanna to go to ads and conversion tags. Now from here, you're gonna to wanna to grab that conversion tag that you have created or if you need to create a new one, just click this little link, create new one and just go through that process. It's really simple but I'm gonna show you how to do this really fast. I already have this installed on my site. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is copy this code, go to your WordPress dashboard, scroll all the way to the bottom where the Divi options are, go to theme options, and then go to integration and scroll to the bottom here. And this is where your pin track code is going to live. Now you're gonna just install that straight in there and hit the save button down below and your Pinterest base code is now installed. Now the second part of this, if you want to track certain things on certain pages like signups or if you have a thank you page that you direct your checkouts to, then you're gonna wanna do something around that too. So the two things I always track on my stuff is checkouts and signups. I'm gonna show you how to do a signup. So in the same screen, just scroll down a little bit, choose the lead type and then click copy code. From there, you're gonna to wanna to go to whatever page you want it installed on. So just go to all pages and we will find a page. Let's just create a new one really fast. I'm gonna say thank you. I'm gonna wait for it to populate. It takes forever sometimes. Okay, we're gonna to go to use the Divi Builder and use Visual Editor. Now this is a really blank page because you haven't designed anything on it yet, but this is really important. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click this little blue plus sign and we're gonna do regular, no, actually, I take that back. You're gonna click the little blue plus sign and you're gonna click full width and full width code. And then you're gonna paste that code into this page. You're gonna click the okay button. Now that you have that saved, you're gonna go up here to this first section that was there and you're gonna delete it. Now you don't wanna do anything up here so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna move this up. So we want it to be at the top of the page. So you want this to fire before anything else fires um, after they hit this page. And then from there, you can go on to designing your Divi thank you page. Now this is the URL that you're gonna take and you're gonna put it in your convert kit form so it will forward to this page as soon as they sign up for your lead. Or if you use another service provider, that is what you're gonna wanna do. So you're gonna wanna refer all traffic after they sign up for that lead magnet to this page. And that's it guys. That's how you install your base code and conversion codes on a Divi website.